Go. Yay! Star Trek installment of Conic Sections, the Hyperbola. It's the last of the Conic Sections. It is the hardest of the Conic Sections. No. And I'm not speaking about how hard it is that way. I'm speaking about its difficulty. <laughs> we can uh, do it! Yay, Matt! Latus Wrong <laughs> shape, but I love the Latus Rectum. <laughs> Alright, rock on. It's out of this world. <laughs> It is. And this is a pin, by the way, so if it pricks me, and don't think of me as a weak Captain Kirk. Except that, yeah, no, you play oh. Jetsons. <laughs> you should speak like William Shatner this whole class. Right. Here we go. So, the hyperbola. We're going to build on what we know with the ellipse. So, if this were... Here we go. If this were the ellipse, let's say, you know, no, both are squared. Or if the circle, let's say, both are squared. What is the vertex of this particular hyperbola? Zero zero, zero. zero, zero is the vertex, correct. All right, and now, if this were a nine and a four, so if the vertex or the center is zero, zero, how far left and right would we move? Three, nine, three, 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 three left oh, and right, and, right, and, right, and, right, and two, two up and down. down. Okay, so similar concepts, right? But the way to tell the difference between a hyperbola and ellipse is that now we have a minus sign, Ooh. right? So we have a minus sign, yeah, minus. <gasps> yeah. Anyway, so yeah. so this by just by looking at it, we say, okay, this is a hyperbola. Both are squared, and we have a minus sign between, and there's little fractions underneath. So I heard hyperbola. Ah, hyperbola looks like this. That kind of like two two uh, hyperbolas or parabolas going like that. It could also look up and down. It could look like this. Mm. It could look like that too. Looks like a face. <laughs> so if the x is first, meaning this part's going to be bigger than the y, this parabola or excuse me hyperbola will open to the sides. It'll open on the x. All right. And if y is first, it'll open up and down. You'll see what I mean. You'll see what I mean. All right. You'll see what I mean. Right. Exactly. <laughs> what? Make me bust into a dance. Wow. Okay, so here comes it's the graph. Musical edition. Missed that. Musical. It's level four engine. High school musical. It's all good. So we start here. Then, where do we go? Left and right. How far? Three. 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 Left and right. One, two, three. One, two, three. How far up and down? Two. Yeah. two, good. One, two, one, two. Now, once we create our boundaries, we make a little rectangle, a little box. So just make a little box with a dotted line, like that. All right, Captain Kirk. This is the uh, like porthole to the other dimension. <laughs> I can't see that. It's just a whiteboard. Okay. So we make our box. And now we agree that because the x is coming first, our hyperbola will open this way. Whoa. That and that. Wait, can you explain that again? Please? Sure. It's so mad. Wait, don't you have to draw the axis? We will, we will. Oh. I got it. So, notice x minus y, right? x squared minus y squared. Meaning, <laughs> the x is the dominant one. X, this thing has to be more than the y squared because it results in a positive number. So because this comes first, because it's uh, bigger, our hyperbola will open left and right because x is dominant left and right. Okay. If y came first, we would open up and down. That's the next problem we're going to do. Okay, asymptotes. Asymptotes are lines that the hyperbola will never touch. They are the diagonals of this rectangle, so please draw those. The diagonals of the rectangle are here. And the hyperbola will never touch these lines. And what's it called? 
Asymptotes. I'm gonna type. I'm gonna type it. <laughs> I'm gonna write that. There's a really funny picture online, and there's this guy, and he's like, "I'm like an asymptote. You can't touch this." That is good math humor. <laughs> you can't hate on it. Asym. Oh. P P T O T E. Yeah. Asymptotes. <laughs> okay. Yeah, it's kind of like the next. Let's do some Yeah, there's a lots of. You're, okay, yeah, we've heard that joke. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> You're gonna do that at like the ice cream shop. Like, hey guys, one vanilla? Let's do some I'm sorry, we don't carry that flavor. <laughs> Please leave. Come again. All right. So these are the asymptotes. Now. Let's, we're going to do the equation of the asymptotes, we'll do that in a second.